Hi, folks. Welcome to the Thursday Thought. This week's topic, emotional intelligence. I did a keynote on emotional intelligence last week, and one of the quotes that I love that I use often in this context is from Professor Mark Brackett, who is the founder of the Yale Center for Emotional Intelligence. And he asks the question, are you an emotional scientist or are you an emotional judge? So are you an emotional scientist, someone who is looking at the data, exploring, curious to discover what emotions you might be having, what emotions other people might be having, what triggers those emotions, what stimulates them, what are the you know different emotions that they are capable of showing? Or are you an emotional judge who assumes that people have emotions and feel emotions for certain reasons and that that is a positive or a negative thing. And I love that framing because one of the things that is so fascinating in the emotional intelligence field is how few emotions we are actually able to recognize. Brene Brown did a study of over 66,000 people how asking them to track and identify how many emotions they recognize in themselves and in others. And shockingly, the mean number of emotions that people can recognize is three. Mad, sad, glad. That's it. There are seven basic human emotions and countless others. In fact, Brene Brown wrote a book on emotions called Atlas of the Heart, in which there are 87 emotions and experiences described, and yet most people can only identify three. So maybe we need some more emotional scientists in the world, and I challenge you to go out there and discover some of them for yourself. Have a great Thursday. I'll see you next week.